Hey friends, welcome back to Kimmy's Kitchen and more. I hope you guys are having a wonderful Wednesday. So since today's Wednesday, um, this video is hashtag what's up Wednesday and is an open collaboration that's hosted by my sweet friend Lucia over at Tiho Creates and I'll link her channel down below. She's a very sweet lady, amazing crafter and a wonderful supporter of all of us here on YouTube. Um, and I'm very thankful to have met her here on YouTube. Um, so basically you just get on Wednesdays, put in the hashtag, like it will be in my description box. Um, what's up, hashtag what's up Wednesday in all lowercase letters and tag Lucia's channel. And, um, you can talk about, um, or show anything that you want. Um, today I'm having some water as usual, usual. I, um, there is a possible, um, hurricane coming. Um, so for those of you who are in the path of that, Florida, uh, South Carolina, North Carolina, which is us, um, please be careful. Um, we have done some things this week to kind of prepare in the event that, um, that that were, you know, to happen. Um, and I was out actually doing that just a little bit ago and for my husband and, um, that's why I keep messing with my hair because it's starting to get very muggy out and I just feel like it's like, <laughs> and I haven't really did anything with it today and I need to do something with it. But, um, so for this hashtag West of Wednesday, I'm going to show you and it'll be at the picture when I'm done, uh, showing you this stuff from this small Dollar Tree haul. Um, I'll include pictures. Uh, so, uh, after my son and I walked, typically I'll have iced coffee prior to walking and then I don't usually eat anything um, for breakfast, but this morning I must have burned some calories because I was so hungry. So I made an egg and cheese sandwich on toast. And so I'll include a picture of that. But I also tried out some new coffee that I purchased from a discount store. And it is Godiva brand actually, uh, Cafe Godiva, and it's caramel. Oh my gosh, guys, if you see it, I highly recommend it. I don't know if you'll find it like at Walmart or if you'll find it at, um, I don't know if it would be like at a specialty store or if you could find it on Amazon, but like I said, I'll include the video of it. It, it is delicious. And then I'll, I'll also show a picture of my drink this morning, um, because I had the caramel, uh, Godiva coffee with iced coffee with, um, some whipped cream, which I do not do every day. It's just a kind of a once in a while specialty thing, um, with some caramel drizzled over top. So, um, I'll include those pictures as soon as I'm done showing you this, but I did want to show you this and please go over and show Lucia's channel some love and tell her Kimmy sent you and everyone else, um, check out everyone else in this what, What's Up Wednesday and see what they are talking about or doing, um, in their videos. So first off, I needed a mailer. So I got this mailer here. And then I got a birthday card for my aunt whose birthday is at the end of the week. So I got a birthday card for her. I picked up some extra spearmint gum. I, let's see, I got some of these gushers. The kids love the gushers. I got my daughter some of these fruit gushers. Um, I, got Ruby come over here what are you doing <laughs> Ruby's over by my craft and stuff I saw these in the kids um back to school section and I thought you know I'm gonna go ahead and get those um it says that this brand Alliance is a women-owned company um but this is rubber bands and I'm trying to see how many they put in there I don't think it says it just says, it says assorted sizes is a two ounce bag. Um, but I, I always, I feel like I'm always like scrounging around for rubber bands for, for some reason or another, I'll need a rubber band. So now I have plenty, I'll put some in my craft room and I'll put some in the kitchen so that we always have some. So I got those. And then I got some of this Dermacil Labs Pharmaceutical Research. 
It says it's um, dry skin treatment, original lotion. So it doesn't have like a scent to it. Controls even severe dry skin, skin lipid and EFA treatment, hypoallergenic. So yeah, I needed to go by um, and get a, um, I went and got a couple um, propane tanks filled, you know, in the event that the hurricane does hit us. And so I went into that and then I also haven't tried this lotion. I've never even used this before, but that's such a nice size for $1.25. I was like, oh my gosh. And um, I always feel like I'm going out the door. And even though I lotion after showering and stuff like that before I leave, I always feel like I get in the car and I'm like, ugh, especially now that, you know, this, this summer's here and the skin's drier and you're in the pool and all that. Um, so I was like, I need to get some good lotion and just leave in my vehicle. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to put it back in there. Um, but no, I went to get uh, two propane tanks filled for my husband. And then I went, um, I dropped off some stuff at the Salvation Army. Um, just some things that I'm not going to um, sell and consign because you guys know if you've been on my channel long enough you've heard me say that I consign things um just for extra money for our family and I am uh, not going to consign those they were fine they could consign um uh, but I just wanted to, to bless someone and give them to someone so I had a whole box full of goodies that my husband and I had went through some things and we've been really cleaning out and purging and I've got so much more to go and I'll do it throughout the fall and winter as well um you know, I'm even going to do my jewelry box and my daughter said, mama, you should send some to your, you know, your YouTube friends. And I said, I am. So, um, some of you guys will be getting some stuff too. Um, but yeah, this feels great. It doesn't feel like, um, like sticky and it just feels really great. And look at my hands. They were, I should have showed it before and after they were quite dry feeling before. Um, and then I found these by Jot. It's a six piece magnetic markers. And um, it says, my hope is in the Lord. Um, faith, hope, and love. It says we have hope. Um, I have loved you um, with an everlasting love. So these are really, really nice. Um, and they're wonderful to give out as gifts too. And then I found these. I had not seen these at my store before. It says November 25th, 2023 is the used by date. Um, and they are the Snyders of Hanover pretzel pieces in the jalapeno. And it says a big flavor. I know I just put lotions on my fingers, but let's see if I can get, if I can get this open to the if I I want to try it. Oh. Oh, oh my, as soon as you open the bag. Oh, you can smell the jalapeno. Wow. Maybe I should get a smaller piece. That's what they look like. And they have these in cheddar. Um, and then they had it in honey mustard. I was going to get my husband some, but a lot of times he'll say no, that that stuff's got too much sodium. So I just didn't get them. Mm. Oh my gosh. That is so good, guys. Mm. Oh, wow. I'm gonna have to go back and get some more of those because y'all know how it goes. They get them and then you don't see them anymore. And then you see them in the store, like I've said before, way overpriced. It's really good. Mmm. I would definitely get in trouble with these. That jalapeno taste is just perfect on that pretzel. It's not like, oh my gosh, I need to drink water right now. It's not overwhelming, but it's just got that little bit of a look hick delicious delicious i recommend these for sure let me show them mm -hmm. yes okay like it done chewing <laughs> and last but not least i found this and if y'all know me you've been on my channel long enough you know i am um not a big color person i love color when it comes to like everything else obviously no Ruby you can't have those oh, that will upset your tummy you want to say hi come here come here I'll say hi say hi I oh, know you 
want to kiss me because I have stuff on my lips. Oh, I love you too. Yes. That's my girl. That's my girl. Say hi. <laughs> I love you. Um, but anyways, I don't think I look right in a lot of color. That's why I don't do a lot of color on my face when it comes to lipstick. Um, but I saw this and I was like, you know what? $1.25. I'm going to give it a try. <coughs> Excuse me. That's a little bit of pretzel right there. So let me try this. Um, it says Lip Duo High Shine Cruelty Free 2-in-1 Gloss and Stick LA Colors. And the color is Vibe. We're vibing. Lip Gloss and Lip Duo. Okay. I'm not, putting that I'm not putting that lipstick on. I definitely think that's way too dark for me. It's really pretty and I wish I could give one end to someone. <laughs> but it's unfortunately a duo and so you can't do one without the other. But maybe someday I'll get creative and and use that end maybe like for halloween or something who knows i don't really dress up sometimes we dress up for halloween just to answer the door you know but um oh this smells so good it smells like bubble gum oh my gosh you know what i have my my beautiful mirror here that tony had made for me for my birthday bless you last year in september tony made it for me um bless you and I love it. It's beautiful because Belle is my favorite um, princess. Of course, I love Cinderella too, but Belle's my favorite. Well, that's pretty. It doesn't have like um. It doesn't have like. Maybe I will try the other side because this looks super bright and it's actually not bright on my lips. Bless you, Rube. Um. <clears throat> so maybe I will try this. Look how pretty that is. That's so beautiful. Maybe this won't be as bright as it looks. Some people get mad when I'm like, like I'm not doing a get ready with me obviously right now, but I've done like kind of like get ready type things or like try on for when I'm doing Marie's reviews for like mascara or whatever. And people get mad and they comment down in the comments like, could you move the mirror away from your face? Like you don't know that this is how you put mascara on and this is how you put lipstick. Like you wouldn't put lipstick here, right? <laughs> or up here. So why do I need to move my mirror? <laughs> I don't know. I'm just saying, maybe people were, maybe they were having a bad day and they're like, would she just move that mirror? I don't know. <laughs> people crack me up. <laughs> so I'll move it to the side for y'all. <laughs> and then my YouTube friends aren't going to get mad. It's just random people just say stuff like that. I think they do it just to be silly. <laughs> you know what? If y'all see that, and you're hoping that it's darker in this, it's not. You can see by my lips. I've got the gloss on the bottom and the lipstick on the top. I probably did that backwards, but I wasn't planning on putting my lipstick on, but it's really not. It's it's not bright at all. Oh, turn my mirror down. It's not bright at all, so if you guys wanted it and didn't want something bright, get it. But if you wanted something bright, you might not want to get it. But you know what? I think different people and different uh, lip tones, it may look different. Some people, I actually have darker um, pink lips than um, some people. So maybe that's why it's not coming through for me. Or maybe I need to keep applying a whole bunch of layers. I don't know. But anyways, I hope y'all enjoyed that. <laughs> and I hope y'all enjoyed this video. And if you did, please give it a big thumbs up. And if you've not subscribed to my channel, hit that subscribe button and that bell notification and you won't miss any of my uploads. And I hope you guys have a wonderful, blessed Wednesday. And please go check out Lucia and everyone else. And until next time, bye y'all. Trying out this new Godiva Cafe Godiva Caramel Coffee. We'll see how it is. I'm excited to try it. <laughs>